of Stevens. Stevens, Stevens, going to town. Roman back against the ropes. Roman in trouble early. Stevens trying to put it away. Roman is staggering. Somehow he's standing up. A barrage from Stevens, but Roman is still down. Right. Now he's down. The left got him and he goes down. Huge left hook from Curtis Stevens. The left hook was the key. It set it off in the beginning. Stevens got all over it and got Roman in a lot of trouble. He's still in a lot of trouble here. Stevens is a very good finisher. This is the danger when any middleweight is facing Curtis Stevens. He's very explosive. And Roman, remember, he had a bloodbath the last time out and he hung on to somehow win that fight in the later rounds. But he is facing a devastating puncher here in Curtis Stevens. And that's the problem with Curtis Stevens when you face him. Everybody that he touches, you know, they feel his power. And that left hook is a very serious punch. The overhand right is good too, and he's a very good finisher. So he makes it tough on anybody in, in those beginning rounds. And he bowls Roman back into the corner. Stevens again, nice left. Beautiful punches by Stevens with the ran against the ropes there. Good punches. Stevens has knocked him down once in this round. And going to town again. Very accurate, very hard punches from Stevens to Roman. Roman's in trouble here. He's got to hold on to make sure he gets out of this round. That shows you just how tough Roman is, though. Not many guys would be able to handle this. Looks like he's starting to clear his head a little bit. Curtis he's Stevens knocks him down. This down. Fight's over, he's Dan. out. It's fight's over. over. Stevens has knocked out Roman. And there's the power that we've been talking about, that vaunted power. That's why everybody is talking about Curtis Stevens. He's got that one-punch power in the middleweight division. Unbelievable knockout by Curtis Stevens. Stevens fighting a gritty, tough veteran who had been in a slugfest through nine rounds his last time out in solo Roman. But he hadn't faced anyone that hits like Curtis Stevens. And Stevens Dexon knocks only, him out cold here in round one. Not only can he punch, though, Kenny, he's got great timing. He's got those counter abilities, and he's got that vaunted left hook. He knows when to shoot, he knows how to shoot it, and when he gets an opponent hurt, he gets him out of there. That's what we as boxing fans love. For the tenth time in his career, Curtis Stevens has a first round knockout. We've seen two of them this year, both of them here at Mohegan Sun. Both times with left hooks, Kenny, and both times spectacular. It's very rare that we see that type of one-punch power in the middleweight division. And Curtis Stevens electrifies crowds and very <laughs> shocks his opponents with, uh, with that type of power. It is good to see him back, isn't it? After being off for over two years and seeing what he has done over the last year. Wins for the 25th time, and here is the first knockdown. And here we see it right here, perfect, beautiful move. You see Curtis Stevens catching the right hand with his left glove, coming back with a quick, powerful left hand counter, right on the money. Beautiful shot by Curtis Stevens. Beautiful timing, and you see Curtis is waiting again for Roman to load up on the right hand. Curtis said, listen, I'm gonna trade. You shoot the right hand, you take my left hook. Let's see who wins. Not many in this division will want to have that draw, will they? Beautiful timing. You see, he's just a natural with that punch. He's deflecting the right hand at the same time that he's turning in to rotate and pivot and shoot that left hook. He gets so much leverage and so much power on it. It's just, uh, uh, <laughs> it's beautiful to watch in at full speed.